A year after one county in the east lost its hospital and Eastern Carolina County's EMS team is adapting a new set of protocols when responding to cardiac arrest calls. Gigi Barnett spoke with the Martin County EMS medical director who says the change will save lives. Gigi. Yeah, Dave, Martin General Hospital's doors closed in August of 2023, leaving the Martin County community without a local and reliable hospital system for emergencies. But Dr. Brian Kitch and Martin County EMS are taking steps to provide immediate care to patients in need. EMS clinicians do more than just transport a patient to the hospital especially when the nearest emergency room is more than 20 miles away. Martin County EMS, in a letter to residents, said they will be changing their protocol when responding to cardiac arrest calls. Before, EMS clinicians would perform CPR while transporting the patient to the hospital. Transporting a patient in, in cardiac arrest and doing CPR in ambulance is dangerous and frankly doesn't really work. Now, clinicians will be using the pit crew CPR practice and will treat patients experiencing cardiac arrest at the scene. Dr. Brian Kitch serves as Martin County's EMS medical director and said the decision to update their protocol was necessary, especially since there isn't a hospital in Martin County. We can stay on scene, perform high quality CPR, do things that matter and save lives. Residents are pleased to hear that such a change is being implemented immediately. It'll save more lives. A lot of people have passed because they didn't make it to the hospital. So I think that's a great idea. And they hope that this decision will one day bring more opportunities to improve health care in Martin County. Sooner or later, soon they'll work on getting the hospital back. If not the whole hospital, the emergency room. WITN reported back in May that Martin County officials were working with consulting firm Ascendient to potentially reopen Martin General as a rural emergency hospital. However, before anything can be set in stone, Several factors, like the state of the building, must be weighed by the North Carolina Department of Health and Human Services. Dave. All right, thanks, Gigi. And the Martin County EMS team also encourages the community to take CPR classes to improve patient outcomes and save the lives of loved ones.